But first, we're going to start with this. The U.S., Britain, and France are all strongly criticizing a Russian claim that Ukraine may drop a radioactive dirty bomb on its own territory. Ukraine says only Russia will consider launching such an attack. Russian missiles and drones have caused serious damage in the southern city near the area where Ukraine's army is massing for a likely major offensive. Holly Williams is in Ukraine with more on this part of the story. So, Holly, what is all this talk about a dirty bomb? Good morning. Well, Russia is claiming that Ukraine could detonate a radioactive device on its own territory, an allegation with apparently no evidence to back it up that's been dismissed as false by the U.S. Here in Ukraine, it's instead sparked fears that Russia could itself be about to use a radioactive weapon. In a phone call yesterday, Russia says its defence minister, Sergei Shoigu, told Secretary of Defence Lloyd Austin that Ukraine could be preparing a so-called dirty bomb. A dirty bomb has never been used before, is not a nuclear explosion and would be far less harmful. But by using conventional explosives to spread radioactive material, it's an effective weapon of terror and could contaminate an area for years. In a joint statement, the US, the UK and France rejected Russia's transparently false allegations, saying the world would see through any attempt to use it as a pretext for escalation. If Russia claims Ukraine's preparing something, it means one thing, said Ukrainian President Vladimir Zelensky, suggesting it's actually Russia that plans to use a dirty bomb. The US has repeatedly accused Russia of disinformation and so-called false flag operations in Ukraine, staging violent incidents as an excuse for its brutal invasion. All of these are consistent with the playbook the Russians have used before to set up a false justification to act against Ukraine. And in reality, it's Vladimir Putin who's threatened to use nuclear weapons. The Ukrainian energy minister told us that in this country, they believe him. Do you think it's possible that Vladimir Putin will use a tactical nuclear weapon here in Ukraine? I think he'll do everything. I am expected from them now everything. Russia's warning that the situation here in Ukraine is trending towards, quote, uncontrolled escalation. In truth, though, Russian forces appear to be under pressure. They've rapidly lost territory and they recently switched tactics, targeting Ukraine's power grid. Tony. Yeah, that phrase uncontrolled escalation caught me as well. Holly Williams for us in Ukraine. Holly, thank you very much.